Hey YouTube, what's up? Um, it's Delta Boy Seven Six Seven, and I have quite a dis not disturbing, but maybe an interesting video post to make tonight. Um, I had a friend come to me who's um much younger than I am, and I've been kind of, sort of this uh, this kid took to me. Okay, let me start from the beginning. This kid who's like in high school, he took to me, and he's been you know who come by the house every once in a while and just hang out, whatever, and I really don't associate myself with younger people, like, younger than me, because, um, it can be dangerous, but, and I don't want people to get the wrong impression, but, but anyway, this kid's very mature, and he came to me, and he was, he had some very distressing, um, something distressing to tell me today that he's 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 bisexual and but he prefers guys and he's in a, he's got a boyfriend and um his boyfriend and him are they they they're in a relationship and whatnot anyway so he was over at my house today and he was telling me that the kids in school keep asking him whether he's gay or not and they'd be like you know so and so, do you like girls or do you like guys? Or somebody told me that you told a guy that you liked him and all that stuff. And 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 to be honest with you, I think that's just absurd. I mean, I think that's just crazy. I mean, why do you care? What does it matter whether somebody's gay or not? You know, if especially if they're in high school. Um, it's really none of anybody's business whether they're gay or bisexual straight or not I mean that's that's for that person to know and for you not to know um, because I don't think that it's that it's proper for somebody to come up and ask you are you gay or are you straight or whatever unless the person wants to be open and tell you that they are then it's none of your business to ask them and I wish high school kids would would stop being so inquisitive about a person's sexuality it's none of your business you know um it, it doesn't matter whether he's gay or whether he's straight or he's bisexual or whatever you know mind your business worry about going to school worry about studying worrying about getting an education and getting out there in the world and making something of yourself instead of going through high school wondering wondering whether somebody is gay or straight or bisexual or whatnot um you know, it, to me, it's it's stupid, and my heart went out to this kid because he was like, you know, because I I can't stand to be asked that question all the time because the, they always ask me the same thing over and over, and they won't leave me alone about it, and I can't. He goes, I can't stand the the torment in school and all that stuff. It's not that they're bullying him, but it's just that they they make him feel so uncomfortable that he's thinking about leaving his boyfriend who he really really cares about and start dating girls only just to shut people up in school and to me that's just downright idiotic I mean if you're gonna go through if you're gonna go through all of that effort and trouble to make somebody so uncomfortable that they would have they have to do something that they don't want to do just to pacify you then to me in my book you are just at the lowest part of the totem pole I mean simple as that and to be honest with you you know my thought on my th my take on this is and this is exactly what I tell them I says you know so there's probably some some young high school girl some damn cheerleader cheerleader or something because you know he's he's a good looking kid and you know I'll admit he's a good looking kid and whatnot and I said there's probably some young jealous cheerleader who's bitter that you're gay and that you're dating some guy and she wants to date you so you know or whatever or or some other girl that's bitter because you're dating some guy and not her because high school girls can be evil downright evil and I told him I said you know what just if they ask you the question just give them a simple smile and say what happens between two people should stay private and that's for me to know and for you not to find out 
So I believe that, or I think, and this is the way it should be, is if you're going to be in high school, worry about studying. Worry about getting your education, like I said before. Don't worry about somebody's sexuality because it's none of your fucking business. It really isn't. It's none of your concern. And it does not matter whether that person sexuality really is. It has it's it has it does not benefit you in any shape, form, or fashion for you to know that other person's sexuality. And I'm not just talking about high school people, I'm talking about people in general. Okay? Because there are some people out there that are just so desperate to know what your sexuality is. Are you gay? Are you straight? Are you bisexual? Are you lesbian? Mind your business. Worry about yourself. Worry about what's going on in your own backyard. Quit worrying about what's, what, what somebody's sexual preferences are. Because it is none of your business. Unless you have some kind of involvement with them. Whether it be relationship-wise or family-wise. Then, yes, you have the right to be inquisitive. But if you're just some random person or some person in high school or college, it is none of your damn business what that person is. What their sexuality might be. And now that I've gotten a lot more mature, and I told this kid, I said, you know, as you grow up, I said, as you get older, it gets a lot easier. It becomes more easier to deal with, and you learn to respond to people in a different way. And um, quite sarcastically, might I add, you learn to respond to people, and they usually shuts them up the first time. Um, I thought I said, now you're just young and you've got a lot of peer pressure because there's a lot of peer pressure in high school. I said, so you're young and under a lot of peer pressure and you have to, because in high school, I told him, I said, you know, in high school, you, you are made to feel like you have to conform to this image. And I thought I said, just be who you are. Be yourself. Be who you are. I said, and whatever you do, if you care about this boy, do not leave him to pacify other people or to make somebody else happy because in the long run you're going to be miserable and I believe that he took my advice to heart because at the, at the end at the end of our conversation he was like you know he's like you're right he goes I'm gonna stick with this with this person that I'm with now and screw him he goes who cares what they think and I said that's the way you need to be about it that's the way you need to look at things and I just want to tell people out there you know Mind your business. Stay out, of, stay out of other people's backyards, honey. Worry about what's going on in your own backyard, because I am sure there are tons of people out there that got all kinds of different issues. I know I do. And I'm sure that half the people out there in this world, I'm sure everybody in this world has got some kind of issue that they need to be dealing with rather than worrying about somebody else, whether they gay, straight, bisexual, or lesbian, because it does not, it does not matter to you. And it should not matter to you, is what I'm trying to say. And it's none of your business. They ain't paying your bills. They're not eating at your table or sleeping in under your roof. So why worry about them? Worry about yourself. And to you high school kids, worry about worry about getting your education. Quit worrying about whether somebody's who's what what none of the person's sexuality is because it ain't none of your business. I know you high school kids like to gossip because I was in high school once myself and I loved to gossip when I was in high school. But you know what? Now that I look back and say, gee, all that gossiping that I could have that I did, I could have got an A or I could have got a an A in science or in foreign language or whatever the case might be. Worry about yourself. Like I said, worry about what's going on in your own backyard. This is for you high school kids. Worry about what's going on in your own backyard. Quit worrying about whether somebody is gay, bisexual, because it is none of your concern. It does not concern you whatsoever. And to you kids out there that are in high school, that are gay or bisexual or lesbian or whatnot, when somebody asks you, are you gay? Do you like girls? Do you like guys? Do you like both girls and guys? Look at them straight in the face and give them a big smile and say, it's none of your concern. What happens between two people should stay private. 
And if that don't get them off their back, look them straight in the eye. Don't smile or nothing says, and just be as rude as you can or as cocky as you can. Be like it. What the fuck business is it of yours? Mind your own damn business, because you know what? You ain't got no business meddling up in my shit. What I do is my own damn business. You stay the fuck out. And that should shut them up. So I'm going to post this video. Everybody rate, subscribe, and comment. And now I'm going to get a bunch of comments that say, well, this, this, you know, I don't care. I don't give a damn because my opinion is the correct one. Because it is really none, none of nobody's business what anybody's sexuality is, for that matter. I don't go around asking a person, are you straight? Are you a breeder? <laughs> Who cares? I live my life the way I want to live it. You live your life the way you want to live it. Fine. I don't meddle into your business. You don't meddle into my business. That's the way I see it. And that's the correct way. That's the way it should be. That's why I said my opinion is the correct one. So, to all my friends out there and everybody on YouTube, and for those of you who are young and in high school and you're just not coming to terms with your sexuality, to hell with what your peers say in high school. Screw them. It don't matter. Because remember something. After graduation, everyone's going to go their separate ways. You'll never see, you'll probably never see them again. Hell, I don't see half the people I went to high school with, and I'm glad I don't see most of them. So, just remember that. It's a temporary thing. It's a temporary click. Once you, once you leave high school, that's it. Gone. This one goes this way. This one goes that way. That one goes off to college in a different state, and so on and so forth. So... And if there is some bitter person that wants to date you and they're bitter because you have a different sexuality, screw them, honey. They can find somebody else. There's plenty of other fish out in that sea for them. So, that's my video. Y'all rate, subscribe, and comment. And um, everyone just stay out of everybody's business. Worry about what's going on in your own backyard. All right. That's my video for tonight. Good night, everyone.